Hey y'all, it's crazy out here though. Man, uh, the freaking Chargers got Khalil Mack. Khalil Mack attack though. What do you guys think about that, man? I think the Chargers, they're uh, they're going for it, man. They're going for it all. Uh. <clears throat> because for one, you know, her, they're not paying Justin Herbert yet. You know, like he, he's not getting paid uh, how he's really supposed to get paid just yet, you know, because he's like one of the best quarterbacks already, top seven, top eight quarterback already. And that's real, in my personal opinion. Like, he got all the arm talent with his 6'4". 240, 65, 245. So bad, man. That's so bad, man. He's one of the best. Best to do this stuff, man. Like, I think, like, you know, he got my boy Mike Williams, who I always say is the Julio Jones. Um, yeah, we got Julio Jones talent, size, speed, playing style, etc. You got, uh, Austin Eckler, who I always say is the Christian McCaffrey of the AFC. Got my boy from Cal, Keenan Allen. He throwing them balls too, man. Wow. Their, their uh, rookie left tackle had like a rookie of the year caliber, caliber season. Still got Joey Bosa. He's the other Bosa. Besides my 49er Nick Bosa. But, uh, hey, big ups to uh, the Chargers, man. They're Got to give kudos on, on, on that trade, man. Getting Khalil Mack to pair with Bosa. So you gotta, you, you gotta have, you, you gotta pair up with people, man. It's, it's, it's part of this. Uh, that's how it is. Whether it's in baseball, you wanna uh, pair a couple pitchers together, a couple hitters together. Uh, basketball, you know, have stars all the time. You know, got the Nets. They try to do the big three thing. LeBron James always tries to create big threes. You know, uh, the, the Super Team Miami Heat did the Heatles. The Warriors did. They added the Durant. You know, I mean, it's been going on for years, but um, at the end of the day, you gotta do what you gotta do to win, man. That's what the Charters did. Freaking Charters, man. But that's smart, though, man. Go for it all while you're not paying that quarterback top dollar. Why not? It's only smart. I mean, this dude is talented. So you you, you got to surround him with everything. Now you got to go for it all. I mean, when the Seahawks, when, when they went to back-to-back -back Super Bowls, you know, they weren't paying Russell Wilson yet. You know, that's why they were able to have all these guys, you know, on the uh, team and stuff, man. Like, because they got, you know, because you weren't paying the quarterback. So you can fill the defensive spots, the weapons. You know, have a Marshawn Lynch on your team, add a Percy Harvin, Cam Chancellor, Earl Thomas, and you can have all that on the team. Sherman, I mean, some of them weren't even getting paid just yet, but weren't paying them. Anyway, the Chargers, they, they, they doing their damn thing. Uh, my 49ers, we'll see you in the Super Bowl, Chargers. We'll see you in the Super Bowl. Now, it might happen, you never know. Don't be hating, it, it might happen, y'all. I'm just saying. Um, we doing big things though, man. San Francisco 49ers, you know it. You know it, man. We're gonna come up, but I'll give the Chargers credit. You know, I'll give the Broncos credit. The AFC West is gonna be rocking, socking football, man. Derek Carr is the fourth best quarterback in that division. He is. You know, um, so the Raiders gonna they gonna have their hands full, man, with that, man. They they I, I, I don't know what they're gonna do, man. Cause you got to go Mahomes, Herbert, and Russell Wilson, and the thing is, is like they all got weapons around them, you know. Tyree Kill, Kelsey, you got uh, the Denver Broncos, Corlin Sutton, uh, Jerry Judy, you know, it's Tim Patrick, super underrated. It's my boy right there. The Chargers, I just named them. Keenan Allen, you know, Mike Will, man. So yeah, man, the AFC West is gonna be rocking, socking. Hey, that's gonna they're gonna all beat each other up. But my 49ers, we gotta face that division next year, man. 
So I guess we, we gotta be ready to face them, right? We gotta be ready to face the, the big time. Feel me? We got to, y'all. <laughs> I'm just saying, but y'all ready for some football, man? These teams are making moves out here. Ah, Chia making moves out here, though. 49ers, when are you going to make your move? We got some moves coming up, too. But right now, the AFC West, they making moves. Khalil Mack and Russell Wilson goes to that division. Now, Russell Wilson tormented my 49ers. Now, he's going to torment, you know, that, that division. Raiders, y'all used to always say, Russell Wilson, he owns you. Russell Wilson, he owns you. I got brothers who do that. Russell Wilson, he owns you. Okay, well now, Raider fans, Russell Wilson is now in your division. Good luck with that. So, yeah, um, I'm just saying. So, you guys might get that karma, reverse karma, Raider fans. I don't know. We'll see what's up. But the AFC West is going to be a battle. So, man, Khalil Mack, he's familiar with that division, being with the Raiders. Now he's going to pair with Bosa. He's going to get after Carr. He's going to try to get his payback. Hey, I'm just saying. But what you guys think about that though, man? Hit the hit that comment section though. AFC West. My 49ers gotta face that division next year. What's up though? I think the Chargers, they can come out and win it. I think the Broncos could, the Chiefs. They could, you know. What you guys think though? Like and subscribe and hit the notification bell, y'all. And pop your collar. Alright? Yeah. Notification bell, AFC West, but the 49ers. We're gonna go 4 0 against that division next year. 4 0? Nah, I don't know. I'm hoping. I'm hoping we will. We'll see what's up. But hey, like and subscribe, hit the notification bell. Yeah.